Timothy is reshown, 1 Timothy 2. I exhort, therefore, that first of all, supplications, prayers, intercessions, and giving of thanks be made for all men, for kings, and for all that are in authority, that we may lead a quiet and peaceable life in the fear of Yahuwah and purity. For this is good and acceptable in the sight of Yah, our Savior, who will have all men be saved and to come unto the knowledge of the truth. For there is one Yah and one mediator between Yahuwah and men, the man, Yahusha HaMashiach, who gave himself a ransom for all, to be testified in due time, whereunto I am ordained a preacher and an apostle. I speak the truth in Mashiach and lie not, a teacher of the other nations in belief and truth. I will therefore that men pray everywhere, lifting up holy hands without wrath and doubting. In like manner also that women adorn themselves in modest apparel with shamefacedness and sobriety, not with broided hair or gold or pearls or costly array, but which becomes women professing reverence for Yahuwah with good works. Let the woman learn in silence with all subjection. But I suffer not a woman to teach, nor to usurp authority over the man, but to be in silence. For Adam was first formed, then Chua, and Adam was not deceived, but the woman being deceived was in the transgression. Notwithstanding, she shall be delivered in childbearing, if they continue in faith and love and holiness with sobriety.